Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 51. And we have a new element we're introducing. First of all, let's talk about our mission. We have to clear out 10 jelly. We've got 35 moves to do it. We've got this meringue frosting, we know about that. But then we have this chocolate. This is the game that will make you hate chocolate, I'm sorry. It, well, it did that for me anyway. What we need to do is uh, be careful of this chocolate because the chocolate can actually grow. If you take a turn where you can take out a piece of chocolate and you take it out the same way you would take out the meringue, which is making a strike next to it or using a special to strike it directly, if you can do that, if you can remove one piece of chocolate or more, then on the next turn the chocolate won't grow. But if you fail to do that, the chocolate's going to grow into an available space. And by available, I mean it needs to be horizontally or vertically next to a piece of chocolate. It needs to be populated by a candy so it wouldn't, the chocolate won't grow onto the meringue. It also needs to be stationary. That's not important now, but later we're going to have conveyor belts which move along the board. And so uh, we can't, the chocolate will not grow on a conveyor belt, which is good to know for the future. So it's going to fill this double thick jelly over, which means we're going to have effectively three layers. Now the other thing it does is it covers the layer so completely that we can't see if there's jelly under there. If uh, a piece of jelly is covered by something like meringue, you can see the fringes of the jelly. There's no jelly here. But once this grows, we won't know if we've already cleared out the jelly or not. So that's the other thing we have to do is really pay attention to the chocolate and where it's growing. All right, let's see what we can do with our 35 moves. Trying to get down to the chocolate. See, there it grew. And uh, first we have to cut through this meringue. And then we have to get down that way. So tough to do. Good thing I have a lot of moves. Make a cascade. Okay, here we go. So now I took out a chocolate. So now a new chocolate is not going to form. And thankfully I can take out another chocolate. So no new chocolate can form. Next turn I can't really take out a chocolate. So I'll take out the meringue. Knowing that chocolate is going to grow. And it can grow anywhere. As a matter of fact, if you've got nice specials, it might grow over the specials. Um, it tends to avoid the specials. But don't get your hopes up because it can grow anywhere. If it has a choice, it usually doesn't grow on specials. All right, so now not only do we have this, and it can't grow on this special because it can't grow diagonally. So let's try to use this before this area gets covered over. Here I'm going to use one special to send off another, and that should bring this down further. Okay, so now I've got this cleared out a bit better. I took out a chocolate, so no new chocolate can form. I can't quite do that this time. I could make this special, but I'm going to go this route. And this should take out the top portions, which is nice. It doesn't even actually have to hit it directly. Ooh, a lot of specials. I'm going to ignore the fact that I can take out chocolate, and I'm going to work on making a couple of specials here. Yeah, I think that was a good choice, because now I'm going to bring them down and set these off together and blow this thing up. And look what it left me. Nice. Okay, that's getting a bit dangerous. And I don't have any great moves. So I'm going to take out a color. I'm going to take out all red from the board, concentrating the colors down, removing some of the chocolate. And then if I can get all of the chocolate removed, now I don't have to worry about the chocolate. And while I was taking out the chocolate, I ended up getting the jelly. So that's how we beat this level. We're going to have a lot of other tricky situations with that chocolate, so be prepared. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. And as always, thanks so much for watching.